Mobile World Congress 2023 in Barcelona. I am Linda Grasso and today I have the pleasure to talk with David Lawrence, who is the Senior Product Marketing Manager at VMware. So David, we are here in this amazing sustainability area and I know that VMware is a continued commitment to sustainable digital infrastructure, so helping their customers to reduce carbon emissions. But my question is, how do you manage to save energy consumption without compromising network performance? Yeah, no, that's a great question, Linda, and welcome to Barcelona. Thank you. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, so uh, one of the really innovative uh, solutions that we're showcasing this week is uh, energy savings within the radio access network. Okay, and so what we're showcasing is within an open RAN uh, architecture, the ability to scale up and scale down radio sites based on user capacity. So currently in the traditional RAN, radios are running all the time at 100% power consumption. Yes. And it's incredibly inefficient from an energy perspective. And so what we've done within our VMware RAN Intelligent Controller is we've set our ecosystem platform for our apps to come in and be innovative, and that's really the benefit of Open RAN. So VMware specifically has uh, designed uh, an R app, mm -hmm. VMware Energy Savings R app, okay. and that app allows us to pull data and capacity from the radio access network to dynamically scale those towers, power them up, power them down, so that only the right resources are being used at any given time to lower the total cost of ownership across the radio access network. That's great. So flexibility to enhance energy efficiency. That's a great concept. So thank you so much, David, for sharing this with us. Yeah, thank you for stopping by. So what VMware is showcasing here is a traditional RAN deployment across the city of Barcelona. So we have traditional RAN cellular sites across the city, and we have these objects that are showcasing demand capacity on the network. So one of the benefits of an open RAN architecture is the ability to be, have, be innovative within the RAN. Okay? So what we're showcasing here is the VMware Energy Savings R app. So what that does, it allows us to manage capacity across network sites, but turn the power on these radio sites up or down dependent on capacity. So you see over here, there's a limited number of uh, users demanding content. So there's less capacity there. But as the network scales up, that cell site starts to ramp up. So these radio sites don't need to be operating at 100% at all times. In fact, we can scale them down to about 50% based on capacity without sacrificing network performance. Transforming public safety with secure connectivity and edge computing. I am here at MWC VMware's booth and yes, there is a Tesla behind me. But more importantly, I am in good company with Gavin Lee, Lee Solutions Engineer at VMware. So Gavin, we know that the paradigm shift of digital transformation has revolutionized our world. And through VMware solution, today it can also maximize the efficiency of police procedures. Would you like to tell us more about that? Yeah, sure. So um, the really, the whole concept of the mobile intelligent edge really kind of was born out of a traditional bricks and mortar deployment of our SD1 technology. So we were really transforming um, the network at um, a UK police force and they were so impressed with the technology they came up with this idea this concept of wouldn't it be great if we could actually put this in a vehicle and turn that into a connected car and really what they were looking to achieve is a mobile office on wheels and so that's where we kind of started out and so I um, visited their vehicle workshop and had a look at the, um, the vehicle and, and the technology that they currently had in the vehicle and I immediately saw an opportunity to really change um, the way that they operate those vehicles and really build um, a future-proof platform. So it was through, very much through a, a partnership and a collaboration with the police force. Um, so really what we um, aim to do is do what VMware has done for data centers for the last 25 years, which is to really virtualize the car. And that enables the police force to start to remove all the excess weight out of the vehicle, start to look at saving, uh, you know, saving fuel, and, and gaining efficiencies in that way, but also providing them a level of connectivity that they don't typically have in, in police vehicles. So 
they really needed secure, reliable connectivity. And the reason for that is to be able to then enable them to use the technology. So they've got the technology in the right place in the right time. So as we know, police officers don't typically work within a traditional office environment. We need them out there protecting and serving our, you know, serving our um, communities. So really having IT at the forefront um, in the vehicle with them so that they can access those applications as and when needed, rather than having to, you know, work work back in the office to do, you know, some of the administration that we know police forces needed to do. Yes, that's definitely innovative and really effective. So thank you so much, Gavin, for You're sharing welcome. your insights and for your precious time. Thank you.